Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Well, the haircut's done, the hair's gone. Um, um, sad to see it go, but oh, it feels so much better. Um, he did cut it a tad shorter than I really wanted, wanted him to, but this is, you know, exactly how I had it. Oh, must be getting on for two, two years ago, two and a half maybe. Um, all cut in at the front, all feathered in. Um, and then the back. He did cut off about two inches more than I wanted him to, really. Um, let me just drop the camera a little bit. Sorry, I'm out of shot. Um, so my hair comes to here now. It's just sort of top of my bra strap. I did want it um, a couple of inches longer, but it will grow. Um, if you remember, my hair, the longest point, was down here. No, I hope I'm in shot. I hope you can see. Let me just check, yeah. Um, now you can see, actually see, because it was the longest point, it was here. Um, just at the sort of top of my jeans where my waist is. Um, you can see how much I actually had cut off. So, we'll <coughs> just put you back up again. But, yeah. I feel, my hair feels a lot better for it. I hope you can see in this lighting because I've only put up my quick lights. I've got hair stuck. Oh, I hate that one. You come back from the hairdressers and you get hair stuck everywhere. Um, it feels so much better. Um, see, it is quite, <laughs> it is quite short at the front. Um, I was expecting this bit to be sort of here. But, um, yeah, it will go. I haven't tried if I can get it up into a ponytail yet. I hope I can. This will be a test. Yeah, that's going to go up. But I doubt very much I'm going to be able to plait it for a while. I'm certainly not going to be able to plait it. So it's just going to be, because that's certainly not going to go over the top and stay. Um, I mean, you're looking at here. So I'm not going to be able to do that for a little while until it's grown out a little bit. But, um, but I'm going to be able to put it up into a ponytail. I'm certainly going to be able to put it up into a bun because it's not always that you want your hair hanging down. You do want it up out the way sometimes. If you if you have long hair, you will know what I'm talking about. It just sort of get, annoy you a little bit every so often and you sort of want it away, um, out the way. But yeah, um, so there you go. It's gone. I feel... I feel like, sorry I've got lipstick on my teeth, uh, I feel like I've had years taken off of me. Um, I feel, I feel a lot younger, I hope, <laughs> I hope it's made, taken years off of me, because um, I was feeling, with it all sort of just hanging down, you know, uh, around my face, and it being so fluffy all the time because I used to straighten it and it would still go fluffy. I felt very frumpy. Um, I wasn't sort of feeling good about myself with my hair the way it was. Um, and I'm, I'm happy. I just wish it wasn't quite as short as it is but I love it. I really do. I'm so happy with it. Um, there's a couple of things I want to show you. Um, actually four nail varnishes and something else. Um, I showed you in a haul um, a few days back now that I bought this Tanya Burr nail polish. This is the, the purpley one, um, which is called New York Night. Got that from the factory shop for a pound. A couple of days ago I went out and sorry, I picked up this one. I got it also for a pound and it is called bright and early. It's a lovely peachy
yeah, it's a peachy shade. I'm just checking the other colour. Look, nice peachy colour. I don't think it's what I have on at the moment. Could be what I have on now. No, I don't think it is. I think this is the other one. Um, yeah, so I've got that one. And this is the one I have on. Yeah, that's the one I have on now. Um, so I got that one, and this one is called. Crumbs writing is so small. That's not what it's called. Um, be bright. Be happy. Be you. So it's be be bright. Be happy. Be you. And that's what it looks like. And then the other one that I have on my nails at the moment is called Penguin. Penguin Chic, I think. And that's what that one looks like. And then what makes number four is this lovely turquoisey blue colour and it's called Little Duck. It's that um, duck colour, isn't it? What do they call it? Duck egg blue? Something like that. I think that's very, I don't know if that's the same. But it's like a turquoisey, this is the turquoisey blue one. I've not tried this one yet. Um, but Excuse the, the chipping, it is starting to chip now, but I have had this on for five whole days and it has just started to chip this morning. Um, I am very, very impressed with the Tanya Burr nail polishes. Um, I think we, you know, that one's got a couple of chips and they're not huge chips. Um, but yeah, just started to chip this morning. Um, there are some of them that haven't got chips on, they're just starting to wear on the, the edge, but yeah, very impressed. Um, stay, it's, it's, um, I think I found a nail varnish at the moment that is, is staying on my nails better than any that I have at the moment. The other thing I wanted to show you is this Men Nivea Men Sensitive Post Shave Balm. Now this is going round YouTube like wildfire at the moment, um, using it as a primer. Now, when I bought this, YouTube, no, YouTube, um, Superdrug had, I paid three pounds for this, um, but they had an offer on, I can't remember what the offer was. Um, three for two, no, two for, Two for six pounds, I think it was, because they're usually five, five ninety nine or something. I can't remember what the offer was now. Shut up, Caroline. It was I paid three pounds for it. Let's put it that way. Um, I've been using it um, the last three times that I have put foundation on, and so far I'm liking it. Um, I mean, obviously, this is not the right light to be showing you my face um, to, to give this. Um, this is not a review. I'm just showing you and telling you that I am I am trying this. Um, I will, if you're interested, I will um, do a review on this when I've worn it for another week or so, so that I can get a, a decent um, idea um, on what I think, and I'll come back to you and let you know then. So that is the video for now because I'm trying to keep it short. I've probably been talking for too long already because um, I'm going to try and upload this now so um, you've got it uploaded for the day hopefully. So yeah I'll give you one last look at my hair. There you go. And I hope you all like it so bye for now and thank you for watching.